what's up YouTube, it's your boy Mastermind here, and today I'm going to show you my GoXLR settings. I know a lot of people in my chat have been asking um, how I set my GoXLR up and what I use differently than most other people. So uh, we're going to go through um, the whole GoXLR software. Uh, this would be after you plug, you know, your XLR mic in um, and the, the XLR plugs into the computer. Um, make sure everything turns on, and this would be my PC profile, not my console profile. Um, if you guys want me to do a console profile, guys, make sure you smash that like and share button. If you, and if you do want me to do a console uh, profile, just drop it in the, the comments that you want me to show you my console one. Um, I don't play on my Xbox much anymore, but I still have the profile set up for for my Xbox. But um, yeah, all right, let's get let's get uh right into it. I'm gonna switch uh scenes over to uh the Go XLR software. Okay, so we're on the the main page of the Go XLR software here. So these are your profiles: default red, default till blue, default vaporwave. I don't mess with any of those. I made a new I made a new profile here. Then I named it PC Streaming. I have Sleep. That's where it shuts all the buttons off, all the colors. Um, and it turns it basically completely off. Um, you'll never have the Go XLR completely off unless you buy the Switch. Uh, or you unplug it. Um, then I have my console or my Xbox set up. But we're going to go through the PC one right now. So when you first uh, get on the software, something will pop up just like this. I run condenser plus 48. Um, this would be better for certain XLR mics and, um, and certain XLR mics that don't pick up a lot of background noises. You can actually hear some background noise as I'm talking right now. Um, but... Then you have your gain and then your mic meter where you want it to be at. Um, so then once you have that set up, you can mess with your equalizer. Uh, this, this basically changes um, how your voice sounds. Um, and my, my go-to on this would be to drag one of these completely up and then drag it completely down. And you can tell the difference on what it was. Um, and then you, you can fine tune it. Um, and if you want to even go further, you can go in here and enable fine tuning. But that, that, takes, um, that takes some time to do. I, I have yet to do it. And to be honest with you, I don't think I need to unless I'm recording some studio stuff. Um, then you have your mixer. Your mixer is, um, the, if you have, um, the, the large Go XLR, I guess I should say. The large Go XLR has these, these, um, oh, wait, no, these here. These channels, one, two, three, four. These would be your sliders. Uh, I mean, this would be technically on the mini, too, so this would work for the mini. So my channel one is my mic and mute to voice chat. So this would be if I click this button here and I mute it, it mutes to my party, my discord, anything like that. It will mute to my second channel is my voice chat channel, which would be my discord, my my in game like uh if i'm playing valorant i have the output of chat to this so all i have to do is click mute here and i have it mute to stream so it automatically mutes to you guys um this is always a nice thing to have i recommend muting uh having uh this mute to stream uh i don't like mute to e mute to my earphones uh because sometimes i would mute and there would be people saying some, some bad stuff. And then I'd unmute and try to go mute them. And they'd still be saying it. That's why I just mute the stream. Stream can't hear it. It goes through my ears. And then I can figure out who was actually saying what. Um, definitely highly recommend mute the stream on that. Channel 3 for me is my system. 
this would be my game volume. Um, so, so the thing is, is there is actually game right here. You can have set, but there's not a fifth slider. I wish there was a fifth slider on the Go XLR, but there isn't. So I have, I set it to system. So my system would be running through, you know, the regular down here. This is my system. See, um, that's what I run my game audio through. And then I have mute the phone, so I can mute it to my ears, so I can mute the game and just talk. Some games are super loud and get distracted when I'm trying to talk to chat. Um, then channel 4. Channel 4 is my music. So with my music, I actually have... So I, I set music. I go to open sound settings. Go to app and volume. And then right here, I change spotify or pandora or whatever you're using for music i changed it to music so then i can mute the music to my ears but it doesn't mute it to stream so the music will still play and i can talk to you guys and not hear the music but you guys can still hear the music lightly or I will leave it up a little bit while I'm playing like certain games, like uh, New World I was playing. And I like listening to the game itself rather than the music. So I would have music up for my chat because everyone likes the, the, the music, when, especially when you're playing an MMO, um, kind of, you know, keeps the vibes up. Um, so definitely recommend mute the phones, but uh, music, channel four. So then next we're going to jump into the effects effects are named one two three four five six over here um they have pre-made ones here um and you know how to turn these on are actually you click the fx button and then i see i sound like this because i have number one right here selected so you always have to hit FX. FX turns on your your effects. Um, and then, so, so there will be pre-made ones over here. If you want to mess with them, all you have to do is go ahead, hit FX, turn the knobs, one, whatever way you like. And if you like it, make sure you save. Make sure you save. If you ever change anything in this and you want to keep it, save. Because ne the next time you start your computer up, it will be gone. So make sure you always go over into here, go to profiles, and hit save if you change anything. And so that's a really big tip, especially with the next thing I'm going to go over. Uh, but no, effects, um, you got FX. You, as soon as you click FX, I always recommend keeping one of these completely plain. So then when you hit FX, you can still use hard tune and sing or whatever, robot or megaphone. Um, but this i can go into more depth with this um if you guys want me to just drop in the comments and i can go over it um next is the sampler now this is the fun one so um i have all my samples actually filled up except one so this is my last uh one that's not filled so like say so like this one is set up to look at me now look at me now oh that's this one look at me now that's up here at C and then top right. Uh, you just have to remember, remember where everyone you place is. That's the big thing. Uh, but how to record, say, say you're in a game and you want to record someone that's talking in game to you. All you got to do is hold down one of these buttons that isn't taken by another audio. And here, watch. Testing one, two, testing one, two. And uh, so now see how it turned red. Um, it was white before. Now listen. Testing one, two. Testing one, two. There you go. So, and then it, say I didn't like that. All you have to do is click clear. And then back to the one you want to clear. And now you can record something else again. Um, now say you clear something and you want to go find it. There is, it's actually in the GoXLR documents within your, your, fo your folders. So you can go and actually find it. It will be under samples. Um. But yeah, that's uh, the sampler. Definitely recommend. Um, 
using this. You can do some crazy, crazy, crazy good stuff with this. Um, if you want me to go more in depth with the, the how I set each audio up and, you know, how I get audio from, you know, YouTube videos or, you know, just how how I use my samples, I can definitely go through that. Just drop it in the comments. Um, a cough, I don't know what this is, so I just, uh, I don't, I don't mess with that. Lighting, so now you can go through and change all the lighting. This, this, you can just mess around with and find a color that you really like. Uh, cough bleep, that would, that would be, oh, okay, yeah, so cough is, uh, this, okay. I never messed with it, but it's, uh, it's so that, um, say you want to just, you know, cough real quick. You can hold this button down, and it would do, it will just completely mute uh the stream, everything, or well it's your your audio from your mic. Um, now uh lighting this is this is cool. Now this is the biggest thing that everyone wanted me to make a YouTube video about. So this is what we're gonna go over. My routing. This is how I use everything. This is how everything is routed back to the stream, to the game, everything. So my mic, it goes to my headphones so I can still hear, so I actually hear myself talking. But it's not, I, I think everyone should have mic to headphones because then you can tell how loud you are to your stream. Uh, broadcast stream mix. This is mic to broadcast stream mix, you need that. Uh, line out, this is to, um, I, I always have this selected and I forget why. I think this is to, to the mic, and this is the mic. Anyways, and then, uh, sampler, so I can record my audio on the sampler. My chat, chat is always headphones, broadcast, stream mix, and sampler. Music, same thing. Game, same thing. Console, I don't have a console hooked up. This is my PC. This is my PC profile, like I said. So I unselected everything. Actually, I, I don't know. I have samplers selected, but that doesn't matter. Um, line in, same thing. System, same thing. Samples, this is the big thing. Okay. Headphones, yes. Broadcast stream mix, yes. Line out and chat mic. This is if you want your party or your Discord or whatever to hear you play the samples. Um, that's up to you. But then that is my that's my routing. Um, and then system is just where you software update. And you, I definitely recommend checking your software update at least once a month. I always check mine. Um, keep up to date with stuff. And yeah, guys, I uh, I hope. This was helpful. If you guys have any questions with the Go XLR and how I, how, how if I miss something or you're having troubles with the Go XLR, feel free to message me on Twitter, uh, Facebook, TikTok if you want to. Um, all my ads are at Mastermind Gaming. So guys, go drop me a follow on all social medias. Um, uh, stop over my Twitch when we're streaming. If you have a question, I can go through something. Um, and yeah, guys, um, thanks for watching the video. Be, be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and have a good day. Peace.